Jay and I'm here with the seven deadly sins tag. I wasn't tagged by anybody, but uh, as always, I like doing tags and not tagged. It's originally created by Bookishly Meliza. I'm probably saying that wrong, but I'll leave the link down below if you want to check that out. So without further ado, let us get started. The first deadly sin is greed, and you are supposed to name your most inexpensive book and your most expensive book. My most inexpensive book is Teeth by Holly Black. I believe I paid 50 cents for this. I could have picked any book that I went off of Goodreads, but I thought that was kind of cheating because, you know, there's so many of them. But I figured I should probably pick one that I actually spent money on. My most expensive book is actually my mom's, but I stole it from her, so I'm claiming it as mine. And it is The Complete Tales of Winnie the Pooh by A.A. A. Milne. And it was $30, I believe. $35. Next deadly sin is Wrath, and it is which author do you have a love-hate relationship with? I'm going with Colleen Hoover. I read Slammed, and I loved it. I read Point of Retreat, and I didn't like it that much, and then I read Hopeless, and I loved it. I'm hoping to read November 9th soon, but I don't know when that's gonna happen, but I love some of her books, and I hate some of her books, and I feel like that's how it is with a lot of people, so she is the author that I have a love-hate relationship with. The third deadly sin is gluttony, and it is what book have you deliciously devoured over and over again with no shame. I don't really like rereading books, so I don't really have an answer for this, because I would rather read new stories where I don't know the story at all, and I don't know what's going to happen next, because I hate when I know what's going to happen next, so I don't have an answer. The fourth deadly sin is Sloth, and it's a book that you haven't read yet because of laziness. And I'm going with the Motoril Instruments series by Cassandra Clare because they are ginormous and they scare me, and I have not read them yet, even though I know I really should read them. And it's just laziness because there's seven of them and they're all giant. Can't bring myself to do it. But I will do it this year, hopefully. The fifth deadly sin is Pride, and it is what book do you talk about the most to make you sound intellectual. I'm just gonna go with William Golding's Lord of the Flies or To Kill a Mockingbird by Harper Lee. They're the only two classics I have. I'm pretty sure they're the only two classics that I've really read and enjoyed, so I'm going with them because classics always make you sound smart, even if you don't know what you're talking about. Just saying you've read it, people think you're smarter. That's my theory. The sixth deadly sin is lust, and it is what attributes do you like in male and female characters? For male, I like them to be funny and not assholes and to actually have morals. Like when they're like rude. Rude characters make me angry. For females, I really like when they're sarcastic and witty and stand up for themselves. I don't like girls who are like, oh my god, life is so rough. Like, what am I supposed to do? Like, no, be like kick ass and like kill somebody, please. Thank you! And the final, seventh deadly sin is envy, and it is what books would you like to receive as gifts? All the books? Can that be an answer? Because I would like to give that answer. There's actually like a lot that I would love. I would love Winter by Marissa Meyer. I would love Crest by Marissa Meyer. I would like Air of Fire by Sarah J Maas. I would like Queen of Shadows by Sarah J Maas. Basically like the third and fourth books in a lot of series because I always have the first and second books but never the third and fourth. I don't know why. Alright guys so that was the seven deadly sins tag. I will see you in my next video. Goodbye!